We are bringing hope to the battle against COVID-19. Hi, my name is Peter Ho. I'm the Chief Executive Officer of Hope Technique. Uh, as a company and as a group, we are involved in advanced engineering. Hope Technique is an engineering solutions provider. We are anchored in fundamental engineering, whether it's mechanical, electrical or software engineering. And based on that, we tackle challenges and uh, problems across different sectors. And it can range as much as far as emergency vehicles like red rhino fire trucks, indoor farming, the growing of Xiao Pai Tai 2.0, through to defence equipment, through to equipment in the healthcare sector, uh, the list goes on and on. But um, it's really the art of building things and that's the engineering we're in. So in 2006, four founders got together uh, with the dream that we wanted to continue engineering and not run the typical route of going into management. Um, we couldn't find anywhere to, to do this, so we created a company called Hope Technique. Four founders, 2006, $10,000 paid up capital. Fast forward 14 years, we're very fortunate that uh, we've got a much larger team right now. Um, we have over 130 teammates uh, and we do business in over 11 countries uh, across countless sectors. So with the onset of COVID-19, we were fortunate that we could respond to a lot of emergency demands with uh, rather novel uh, solutions and products. One of the most successful ones we've done was is called the Temperature Assessment System, TAS. It's basically a very, very accurate uh, temperature uh, detection system, measurement system that basically um, exceeds its class. So it's compared to uh, items 10 times its price range, uh, it is much more accurate. And accuracy really matters because in COVID-19, uh, a, a miss measurement of 0.3 or 0.4 of a degree Celsius could completely miss somebody uh, with COVID-19. So another project we've done is what we call the Comet Buses. That has been together with SMRT, Shears Healthcare Group and Tomasic Foundation. What the Comet Buses are, are a novel way to transport a large number of COVID-19 patients safely. So we have divided the vehicles in two, two parts. The first part is where the driver and the healthcare professionals are and then in a separated area will be where the COVID-19 patients are. Um, what we do is we change the filtration system and the air pressure inside the back cabin to ensure that any virus that's in the air per se is unable to get out of the bus and instead it has to go through a very special set of filters that we have to filter the air to make sure that the air that was inside the bus when it finally gets out into the atmosphere is definitely safe and uh, all the viruses and bacteria would have been filtered out. At the same time, that level of protection is afforded to the cabin in the front where the healthcare professionals and the driver are to ensure that uh, they do not have uh, uh, the risk of uh, being infected by the patients. So um, it was a very urgent requirement and we're very fortunate that together with our partners we were able to deliver it in, I would dare say, record time. In addition to my role uh, in Hope Technique, I'm also very privileged uh, to be able to contribute back to society uh, by volunteering in different organisations and different roles. The most recent is to be part of the Emerging Stronger Task Force, which reports to the Future Economy Council. The EST, as we call it, uh, is a task force that aims to get Singapore back on its feet and out of uh, the recession that COVID-19 is causing faster and to come out stronger. My role in the EST is to represent the small, medium-sized enterprises, especially in the area of manufacturing and engineering. We are in most unusual and difficult times right now. Uh, the best ways to get out of it is don't give in, don't give up. Perseverance is key right now. Beyond that, we've also got to learn to hunt in packs, work together more closely. Uh, cooperation is essential. Uh, that's one of the only ways we can come out of this faster, stronger and better.